What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management channel. My name is Andrei and today I'm going to be doing an update on Tesla stock. And in today's video, first of all, I will show you where we are on the price chart and how we get there. Then I will continue with the fundamental news and I will show you why we have for this uh, sell-off during last session. And at the end of this video, I will share my thoughts and my technical analysis and I will show you what should we expect next. And before we get into all of that, if you guys would like to earn two free stocks with Mumu valued up to $7,000, please check out that link in the description below. All you have to do is sign up for an account and deposit as little as $1. This is guaranteed free money. Full details you can see on the screen right now. So let's start with the price chart. I made my previous video yesterday, right here, when the price was at the, about $880 price point. And I've told you that if uh, we will break uh, the bottom of uh, this previous uh, pivot point, most likely we will hit uh, the range of about $800. And as you can see, we are on our way to this range. And my technical analysis uh, was uh, again extremely accurate. And by the way, guys, I made a video when I combined all the technical analysis from the beginning of September 2021 till present day and there you will find how accurate technical analysis is. And I made this video not for the bragging of my results. I show you there not only my wins but also my losses. And the overall win rate for all of these videos are about 80 to 85 percent. That's why technical analysis is extremely powerful and you can rely on the technical analysis in your due diligence if you want to have the best possible price. So, and let's continue with the fundamentals and let me show you why we have this sell-off despite of good fundamental news from earnings report. And let me show you this article. Why did Tesla stock plunge today? Supply chain issues could impact the growth story. And let me quote you these bullets. Tesla is down 11.18% a day after churning out a strong earnings report, but warning that supply chain issues could linger this year to cut into the EV juggernaut's full growth potential. More than 45 million shares of Tesla have swapped hands today. For Q4, Tesla reported revenue growth of 65% year-over-year to $17.7 billion. The automaker reports uh, it produced uh, 305,840 vehicles in Q4, 70% increase year-over-year and delivered uh, 308,650 vehicles, 71% increase year-over-year. And uh, definitely the most concerning part of the report uh, was the potential supply chain issues. And with the anticipation of increased interest rates uh, that will definitely impact uh, the high PE ratio stocks and uh, for now Tesla has one of the highest PE ratio and uh, that is why we have uh, this uh, sell-off uh, in its uh, stocks and that's why we can anticipate uh, the price that I marked right here of about $800. So and uh, what are the upsides uh, for this asset? Let me show you right here. Elon Musk is in agreement with ARK Invest when it comes to autonomous vehicles. And let me quote you these bullets. Elon Musk is in agreement with ARK Invest when it comes to autonomous vehicles as he responded to a threat of tweets put out by ARK Invest analyst Tasha Kinney. Kinney stated, autonomous cars, we think this could be the most impactful innovation in history. Autonomous ride hail could add roughly $26 trillion to global GDP by 2030. In response, Musk tweeted out, Sounds about right for autonomous cars. Optimus will greatly exceed this. The economy will be as big as people want it to be. Uh, there will be no scarcity except uh, that which is uh, artificially created. And uh, right here you can find the entire thread. It is quite interesting. Tasha Kinney posted several tweets about uh, some uh, technical details uh, of this growth, but overall, the total addressable market for autonomous ride hail could be 11 trillion dollars and it is mind-blowing market and it is completely new market and i have to say that these companies who will benefit uh, the first uh, from this growth will dominate this market for several decades and uh, one of these company and uh, i have to say the only one that have uh, full safe driving system on their vehicles is Tesla and they delivered uh, almost uh, 1 million vehicles in 2021, 
despite of uh, chip shortages, despite of uh, supply chain issues. And uh, with the anticipation of uh, two more new plants that will start uh, their production in 2022, the most conservative uh, expectation of uh, their deliveries will be more than 1.5 million vehicles. And uh, it is extremely high number and it is uh, the real leader in this industry. And that's why we can rely on this company as a part of uh, our investment portfolio. Because in the long run, this company still has huge competitive advantages. And uh, they will uh, dominate this market, uh, in my opinion, for several decades. So, and let's continue with the technical analysis. Uh, but before we dive deep right here, please subscribe to my channel, hit notification bell and hit the like button. This helps me a lot. So, guys. Let me show you on a greater scale that uh, we have uh, hit uh, several key ranges and uh, one of them is uh, right here at uh, 852 dollars we broke it to the downside and we form uh, lower lows and for now we are in line with this channel and the lowest border of this channel have the confluence uh, with the 0.786 fibonacci extension level it is the length projected length of the fifth wave compared to the third wave right here and it is also confluence with the $800 uh, price point of Golden Pocket, the most recent wave uh, from this bottom to this one. And statistically, it is the most probable range of trend reversal. On top of that, we have a major pivot point of the top of the B wave. And it is at the price point of about $771. And all these ranges might be a very good ranges of accumulating your position because uh, we have to respect all these supports and we have to have a bounce we are oversold right now let me show you that on a daily time frame as you can see we are touching the oversold uh, border region and this means uh, not so often uh, when we saw this uh, low rsi for this company and that's why in my opinion we are nearing the bottom of uh, the price and that's why if you want to add your position, the ranges below $900 will be extremely attractive in the long term. And let me show you potential targets. If I switch to 2 hours time frame, first of all, if we'll have uh, uh, the range of about $800 as our pivot point, we have to break uh, the upper resistance of this channel. And it will be about, uh, let me show it to you, about 25 and depending on the place where we will break it, from 22 to 25 percent of potential profits next one definitely it will be this swing high it is a uh, 1200 dollars and it is uh, 55 percent of potential profits and the all-time high right here at 56 percent of potential profits at the price point of 1241 dollars so the upside potential even to break this previous uh, all-time high is extremely high and that's why in my opinion the upcoming year will give us uh, this opportunity to have at least 50% of uh, profits with this asset. So, I think from the technical standpoint that's it for now. If you like my video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel with notification bell. And see you guys and girls next time. Bye!